Spotify. This is Masada. Today, Akai just announced the VIP 3.0 software, and it's pretty dope. As you can see here, VIP 3.0 has a few uh, nice uh, options here. It's now iLock protected. You have MIDI Learn now. Presets are now mapped for a lot of Akai and M Audio uh, products. Um, they add things such as, you know, the articulation section, they add things such as flam time, flam randomization, velocity, velocity randomization, uh, velocity scaling, play order. It has uh, scales, harmonize, uh, chord progressions, browser snapshots, preset ratings. This is what I'm most excited about. You have pad chord uh, progressions. Basically, you can use the pads to play chords or you can use the keys to play chords. Most notably, you can use Masada Cycle Kit MIDI progressions inside of VIP now. So they're not just exclusive to MPC. What's up guys, this is Masada from CycleKit.com and I'm excited to tell you that the new VIP 3.0 is out. And the really exciting part is you can now import and export your own progressions. That means that Masada MIDI progressions now work in VIP. All right, so let's check it out. When you download your files from the CycleKit.com, your Masada MIDI pro uh, progressions, um, this is what the folder is going to look like. And it comes with, you have all your information here. And you go inside the folder here, and these are your progressions. These normally, you would uh, use this to install inside of MPC. But I'm going to show you how to install them inside of VIP 3.0. So we're going to open up uh, VIP, activate your scales, Harmony progressions. So we go here to progressions and you go here under this tab here where it says user and you can see they've included a, a bunch of new uh, progressions already built in for you. Um, so we'll select something here. And in order to like hear that uh, progression, you're going to have to select the key. Like here's a start note. So you have to click on here. Okay. See, and I'm not sure of the amount of, uh, of uh, progressions they give you, but they give you quite a lot. All right, so let me show you how you can get your kits in. So you can do one of two things. You can either import it. So you go here. You go to import. And you select wherever you put your, your Masada MIDI progressions file. Put that on my desktop here. And then I select one or however many I want to be imported. So for right now, we're just going to select this one to import this, right? And as you can see, it's there. So, and also you can just drag them in. So we go here to this folder. We'll go here, we'll just drag it right in. Like, so we'll take number seven. All right, so you go here to user, you go find Masada RMB seven, bam. Um, you can also erase things that you don't want. So I just go here to delete, and that's gone. And you can also export uh, all your progressions out. I guess that's it. Peace and respect. One.